what's up JC with Ronnie Strong and just like I share my uh, Sunday prison talks with you guys uh, I'm gonna share my prison letters um, this is from my boy Peanut um, I just recently sent him some pictures so uh, I'm gonna share this guy this with you guys um, greetings big dog I hope when you get this letter you and your family are in, and hopefully you got Oh, hold on. I can't read that good, so let me, let me, uh, let me start again. <laughs> What's up, big dog? I hope when you get this letter, you and your family are in good, and good. Hopefully, you got the drawings already. I don't know what happened. Are still working at the same gym. Well, either way, from now till then, everything to your crib. And I got the money, by the way. I sent them some money. Um, if you guys uh, don't know, actually, um, I've been uh, putting together, uh, you probably don't know because I haven't shared it, so my bad. Uh, I have a lot of prison art that I've been getting sent to me. Um, I am going to actually have a, like you could say like a fundraiser, I'm going to sell them. And you know, some of this money is going to be donated to the nonprofit of Roger Strong and some of it's going to be sent back to the inmates that are sending to me. Uh, Peanut is my number one artist right now. He's uh, doing a lot of time so uh, he tries to send me as much as he can. Um, it's the only way of him surviving. It's the only hustle. So uh, you know uh, I'll be putting up a video later on with all the drawings and everything and, and what we're going to do with them. So I'm going to finish reading the letter. I find myself pointing this pen to the paper because I am in SEG. These people said they found a shank in the cell I was in. I got uh, found guilty on the ticket. So they gave me a year in SEG. So for you guys that don't know, SEG is where you're isolated completely from everybody and everyone. It's a jail inside of a fucking jail. Um, one year in SEG, if you're not mentally strong, a month could fucking make you go crazy. I did six months in isolation and it fucking almost made me go crazy. I used to talk to myself in the mirror. I let my hair fucking grow crazy. I had a beard. I looked like a fucking terrorist. It fucks you up. Humans are not meant to be alone like that. And what they do is they... They don't give you no property. They don't give you shit. You sit in there by yourself, pacing around in fucking circles, wondering what time of day is it? Is it nighttime, daytime? So it's bad. It's a bad situation to be in. This is my dog. I'll be one year in SAG. My SAG outdate is 7-3-2020. Hopefully this doesn't fuck up our function. I am right. So he's still worried, even though he's in SAG, man. My dog is still worried about sending me, you know, drawings and, and take care of, of business, man. You know, um, something I'm writing on something so I can still send you some drawings. You are still going to be getting them. I just have to bust some moves. It's kind of a good thing and a bad thing that I came to say. The good is that I get focused more on my case and focus to do, come up with art for you. The bad is that these people are trying to put a case on me. They already read me my rights. I'm just waiting to see if, they, if the state has to pick it up, the case. Who knows, but I'll see I just might start doing an art book of myself since I have a lot of more time on my hands. Well, just a, just thought I'd write you to inform you about me coming to say. If so, cool with you. Can I have one one of the homies call you to explain some things to you to see if we can make this happen? just to let you know all right i can't use the phone and email or for a year either either only letters stay smooth my brother i hope to hear from you soon p.s 
if you can, please send me a copy of that picture I sent you of me. Thank you. Peanut. So, I'm going to share something with you guys. And then this is like from, you know, the bottom of my heart. Um, I, I write to these guys and I stay in contact with them because I know what it is to, to be in there. I know what it is to to be alone. I know what it is to, you know, be in that fucked up ass system where, you know, these guys are never coming home. And um, I, I, I like to give them an outlet where they can live their lives through my eyes and, and show them a positive note on everything, you know, get their story out there. Um, I just sent them a bunch of pictures of like me, my family, um, just to give them hope, man. and and give them a little bit of a breath of fucking fresh air in life and you know there's there's a lot of people that yes we committed crimes and we're you know paying our debt to society but we were fucking kids that were lost you know how do you fucking give a fucking kid 60 70 years so with that being said man don't judge nobody you never know what they've been through, what they've gone through. And if you see somebody, give them a fucking hand, man. This is JC Rock Strong. I'll catch you guys on the rebound.